Hey, this is Sabrina, and today I'm going to show you how to add uh, upsells into your courses. So what you're going to do is once you're in the course, you want to create an up upsell for you're going to go into pages and you're going to want the upsell to be on the thank you page. So they've seen the sales page. They've already checked out. They've given you their card information. Now you want to give them a one click upsell to make it nice and easy for them to um, add that to their order because they've already put their information in the system. So you're going to go to the thank you page and you're going to hit edit. And then what you're going to do is you're going to scroll down um, and you're going to go into upsell offer. Um, now you can put this block anywhere. So if you hit insert a new block and go to other blocks, um, upsell offer is also in that list. So you don't have to use it in their suggested blocks section. You can actually put it anywhere on your page if you want. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on upsell offer. Then it's going to have you select a course. So you're going to go ahead and choose um, whichever course you want to upsell them on. So I'm going to go ahead and choose our webinar that we have coming up today. And um, then you can choose the pricing plan. So if your course has um, three different payment plans or two different payment plans, you choose which one you want to upsell. Then you can choose to put a coupon on there. So um, in my previous video, we went ahead and created a 10% off all courses coupon. So instead of them having to enter a promo code, you can give them that coupon right off the bat. Um, that coupon does expire after a certain period of time. Um, so you may have to go in here and change that after the fact. I'll have to double check and see how, how that works exactly. Um, if you don't want a coupon, you just hit none. And then you can customize your accept offer button and you could say um, yes um, add this webinar to my order adds $99 and then you could say no thanks continue okay now I always like to add a disclaimer in here so I do like to add a text block that says um, by clicking the yes add this webinar to my order button above your card on file will be immediately charged um, $99 for this webinar in addition to your course purchase. Um, this webinar is a one-time sale all sales are final or whatever disclaimers you want to put in there. Okay. Um, but I do always recommend at least this sentence here, letting them know by clicking the button, their card on file will be immediately charged that amount. Um, because sometimes the ads $99 doesn't always make that very clear. Sometimes it, they just think, Oh, it's adding $99 to my cart. No, you want to make sure they know that they are getting charged for that at that moment. Okay. Um, always, 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 be as clear um, as possible with your clients to avoid any confusion throughout the checkout process. That's going to help with your conversion um, a ton. <laughs> okay. So then once you're done, you just go ahead and hit save and your upsell is added in there. Thanks so much for watching.